Namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhasa Namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhasa Namo tassa bhagavato arahato samma sambuddhasa Good evening to everybody. Uh, thank you. And also this evening we would like to share to all of you about four elements meditation. Uh, many people have been listening, some people listen for many times. But also please continue and please try to listen again. Four elements meditation is very important for us to learn. For the beginner, for who practice for the concentration and who practice vipassana. Basis of the vipassana is volume and meditation. So very important for us to learn how to volume and The beginning of the mantra, we always emphasize about the Nova Eightfold Path, and then Sila, Samadhi, and Panya. Samadhi is especially for the concentration practice. For the concentration practice, the Buddha has been teaching us 40 ways of meditation subjects. In this 40 ways, one of four elements also one of the meditation subjects. And some people are very easy to get concentration from Anapanasati. Some people may be a bit difficult. So for us people, and then after one or two weeks of practicing, you don't feel good with Anapanasati. If you want to change to the four elements meditation, also you can change, you can practice too. And some people, uh, after practicing the four elements meditation, they also can get some concentration from the four elements meditation. And then for the concentration practice, we need to practice systematically. We cannot choose what we like. It. Sometimes you will say that, okay, you like about sensation or heat feeling, you will concentrate only the heat, the heat for one sitting or one many days, only with this one characteristic. Some people like about pushing in the body, you will feel a vibration, winning element, because you feel comfortable with that winning movement in the body, that you will choose one characteristic for one or one day or many days of practice. That's because you choose only one characteristic, the element is not balanced in your body, and then it's reason you easily get suffering, pain, and then different kind of vibration, strong vibration. You don't know how to balance on that. This is a problem for the choosing of the one characteristic from four elements. We can see some of the meditators that problem when they meditate. In previous practice, they must concentrate only wind elements for many years. So when they practice for Anapanasati, they start to concentrate on the breathing. After four while, they will feel a vibration in the body, shaking a lot. They don't know how to control it. When they start to un concentrate on Anapana object, they will feel only vibration. That's the reason. And then it's difficult to get concentration for Anapanasati because of the sensation of the body is obvious than the breathing in an opera in the nostril. So what is key? We have to ask them to be balanced, not to penetrate, not to concentrate inside of the body, only awareness on the implant of the nostril in and out, to the in and out breath. Some people can get easily, and compared to the breath, some people it's very difficult, the vibration is too strong. So what is key? We ask them to be balanced, the element in the body first. How to be balanced for wind element? Because of the wind too strong, you feel vibration, and you can see the sample. One of the paper you put under the fan, and using it, and slowly you have fever because of the speak of the fan, you see the vibration of the paper by moving a lot. And then, so we using heavy stone or crystal ball, put it on top of the paper. After a while, you have the paper is stable, not moving anymore because of heavy stone. Same as that sample in our body, when shaking a lot in your body because of the wind element too strong. So we practice earth element, hardness, roughness, and heaviness. When you practice for heaviness, the heaviness of the energy will support for you to be balanced for shaking feeling. So after for a while, your body is very stable and very stick. 
After balancing the characteristic in your body, when you feel that the body is stable, then the mind is slowly turning to come back to the nostril, trying to feel the breath slowly in an hour. You cannot push too hard. The time if you push it hard, the mind will following with in breath inside the body. When the mind following with the movement of the breath, you will start to feel a vibration inside the nostril. From there, slowly going inside the face and the whole body, then start to feel shaking in the inside because of the wind element because of your mind following with in breath to the inside of the body. That's reason when you come back to the nostril, when you concentrate, slowly trying to feel by in breath and out breath, then the subtle breath will appear, then concentrate continuously. Then slowly your own feet inside vibration, slowly you will feel the breath movement in the nostril. Mm -hmm. This is for the anapanasti, from the elements to anapanasti. Now we want to concentrate on the elements meditation. So for the elements meditation, we need to know what is the four elements. The first one, earth element, water, fire, and the wind. We have four elements. The first one and the earth element has six characteristics. And then so we can divide by two sessions, heavy groove and light group, two groups. And the heavy groove has three characteristics, hardness, roughness, and heaviness. And the light group has soft, smooth, and lightness. Water elements have two characteristics, pro-wind and cohesion. These two are opposite, but the opposite also we call the underwater element. Mm -hmm. Number three, fire element, hot and cold feeling in your body. This is called under fire element. Mm -hmm. Number four, wind element, pushing and supporting. These two characteristics. Mm -hmm. So we have all 12 characteristics and the four elements. So we need to practice systematically and one by one need to be clear. The feeling need to be clear. The elements, objects, the feeling. So wherever you concentrate on the elements, make it to be clear in your body. After successful, after clearing your body, only change to another. So from that 12 characteristics, we can see the wing element, start from wing element. Wing element is easily you will feel, you can feel in your body. So we start from the wing element. Just now in the wing element, it's two characteristics, okay? Pushing and supporting. Now we start from the pushing. The pushing is we can practice from the in breath. Trying to breathe in, deep breath. Now it's a deep breath. Trying to breathe in, when the breath going into the nostril, your mind can follow you with the in, in breath, you know? Following with the mind, following, trying to feel what the breath movement. So you have a vibration pushing inside to the nostril of the in breath, then continuously trying to follow it. But not only in, 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 you know, in breath and out breath. <laughs> Don't forget about out breath. <laughs> Sometimes in, 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 you forgot about out breath also. Difficult to breathe, you start. You know? So in red and out red, the mind concentrate to the in red, not focus too much on the out red. Then after a few breaths, you're trying to do it continuously, following the mind, so slowly, slowly, you have a vibration of the air movement, pushing, pushing. Then the mind following continuously until the top of your head. Then slowly, slowly on top of your head, the one of the focus in the one of the area, then you have trying to feel the vibration on top of your head the point on the top. So slowly you have feel your skin or muscle movement. Then when you feel the movement on top of your head and then trying to feel and contemplate that and there is the wing element, there's a pushing, pushing, pushing. The mind thing about pushing, pushing. After four while, the mind trying to spread and be weaker areas, then you will feel the vibration is spreading. And also at the same time trying to concentrate the whole face and from the shoulder to the whole chest and then slowly, slowly your hand to the leg and then your feet. So trying to feel vibration in your body and then if you, if you can try all the organs, you can feel the organs movement that is also very good for your concentration. Trying to feel more for vibration, then it's only you can tell it, pushing away element. No? Trying to make it some kind of concentration from the wind element. So when you concentrate, no need to be rushed, make it clear. Then slowly, slowly trying to feel from the head, and slowly going down and then your feet again and again, trying to feel. Then, sorry, after for a while you will feel vibration and you feel comfortable with that vibration in your body. So you feel the wind movement 
when because of your concentration, when you start to breathe in, you will feel what the wind movement pushing to the your whole face inside the area is spreading. So very comfortable, very feel very good. Trying to feel in this way. Then after that, trying to follow it inside, you will feel what the air is spreading, you will feel slowly, straight vibrations going to the whole body. Then after that, you get, even you practice one characteristic, also you already penetrate on inside, and then you will get some kinds of concentration. You feel very comfortable, very happy feeling when we arise from there. After successful while wind pushing, then trying to practice about earth element, and the earth element are just now how many characteristics? This characteristic now we can divide two group, heavy group we can start from there, hardness we can practice, you can buy your body, so after for one you have fever your area with the other muscle you can very hard. Hardness of sensation, trying to feel it. So you have fear about the hardness of feeling, trying to the mind trying to concentrate on that area. The mind trying to feel, trying to think about hardness, hardness, hardness. Then slowly the hardness of sensation become obvious. And more, more, more harder, then slowly, slowly trying to spread the mind to look at it at the, the whole face. You feel what very tense and very hard feeling. And no need to stay a long time in the head. If not, you will get headed after a while. Right? So just feel the hardness, then slowly, slowly trying to feel about your shoulder. And same as we element, trying to feel the whole body. After a while, right? the whole body becomes very hard. When you meditate, after one hour of sitting, you feel the whole body to move, it cannot move, feel very hard like a stone. That feeling is because of hardness of sensation in your body and the earth element. No? Number three, roughness. Your tongue push to your upper teeth and move it. Then after the four one, you feel what roughness or sensation in your tongue area. So then for when you're trying to concentrate on your tongue, think about roughness, roughness, roughness. Slowly you feel a very rough sensation. Then after the trying to feel on the upper layer of the skin. So after four one, you feel what roughness and sensation. Then sometimes you feel very itchy in your face. Sometimes you need to come and pinch you at a very uncomfortable feeling. This because of the roughness of sensation and trying to feed the whole body. Number four, heavy. You can use your bow hand put on your leg and trying to bend your body in front. After four, one, you will feel the upper body has come a heavy feeling. So you really feel a heavy feeling, trying to strip back again, and then slowly trying to concentrate from the shoulder on what the whole body, trying to think about heavy, heavy. Then slowly, slowly, you will feel the whole body become very heavy. Then sensation must be appear. Mm -hmm. 那再下来呢，就是这个重，就是说我们用我们的两手呢，就是压在我们的大腿上，然后再稍微的把这个身体呢，就是向前弯，在那时候能够感觉说我们的上身呢有这个重的感觉。当能够感受到之后呢，再把身体坐直，然后慢慢的再把这个重的感觉呢扩散到我们的肩膀到整个身体，只是思维说呢，整个身体都是硬的，呃，对不起，都是重的。Another one is that you can practice at the same time as supporting energy, easy to feed. Supporting is when you get a heaviness and hardness occurs in your body. Easily you feel the energy is support for your spine to be very straight. Some kinds of wind element or the muscle, that will be support your muscle to be very hard and very straight. Sometimes you can bend your body in front and strip it again, so you will feel that the energy is support near the spine, the straight you bet and don't do it no more. When you feel sleepy, the body is shaking and then to shake, move to every direction, eh? the time. And immediately you can stand up, stand up because of supporting energy. Do you have that experience? When you feel sleepy, the body is swimming to which direction, do you know? <laughs> some people left side, some people right side, some people friend, some people behind. No? So in different ways of moving. So but anyway, you nearly touch to the floor, <laughs> you can straight back. That straight back energy is a supporting energy. So if you don't be clearly trying to be sleep again, then you will be easily, <laughs> then you will feel about that supporting. No? <laughs> Do you want to sleep? <laughs> Do you want to sleep? Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow I will come and check who escaped from the sitting. Eh? So there's uh, another one is uh, the softness. Softness very easy to feed. 
your mind need to be soft before you practice for softness. You need a lot of loving kindness to yourself. Then easily you will be soft. If you have a lot of anger in your heart, in your body, what will happen in your body because of the hardness of your mind? Understand? Become very hard. When your mind is soft, a lot of metta, a lot of compassion created, easily you will feel more softness in your body. And also if you don't feel in this way, you cannot practice metta to somebody or yourself, trying to bite your upper teeth to the lower lips, okay? Then slowly <laughs> you will feel the softness of your lips. Then trying to concentrate on that, think about softness, softness, softness. Then slowly trying to feel the whole face, and then up to all the muscles, especially to the muscle. You will feel a very softness, softness of muscle, and then trying to feel the whole body. The whole body becomes very soft. Depends on your concentration. Some people have good concentration, they don't feel even bond or only feel that the whole body is like a the muscle, group of the muscle. This is because of softness of concentration. Hmm? Another one is smooth. Just now you already feel softness on your lips, then you use your saliva to push in that area. Slowly you will feel inner in the of the your and then your, your lips as it all the mus all the skin, you will start to feel a very slippery feeling that is smooth. Then after that you're trying to concentrate on the body, so slowly you will feel why your skin become very slippery feeling, but if you don't feel that they're trying to concentrate inside all the organs, you will feel in when you start to concentrate about organs, you will feel that they're very slippery and moving a lot of inside, because then, then you will see about it's really smooth. You know? Another one is a lightness, you can move your finger trying to push up. So slowly you can move easily the finger away because of lightness of sensation. So trying to feel the lightness of sensation in your finger. After you feel what they're trying to feel by your hand, slowly, slowly the whole body you can also trying to think about lightness, lightness. Slowly, slowly you feel a very light and very comfortable feeling. Depends on your concentration. And when your concentration goes, you will feel you are inside the air, floating, floating, floating feeling. So if your concentration is not good, you just feel very comfortable and very light. And a little bit light and a sensation, it doesn't matter. After you feel it and you're trying to continue with the whole body. No? Another one is uh, fire element. Fire element that is hot and cold. And you can use your tool or the hand, you can touch for a while. After for a while or touching, you will feel in the center part. You feel the heat feeling, hot sensation, it's trying to concentrate on that area. Then about the mind, then about the area, then hot, hot, hot. Then slowly you will feel the heat, then slowly, slowly spread from the hand to the whole body. If you can feel it easily, after four while you feel the very warm feeling in your body. Sometimes you don't feel good from the spreading in that area. You also can choose your mind trying to concentrate on uh, the um, lower part of the stomach. The place uh, always we had a digestive fire because of the karma. Since you are in the mother wound started from the, the heat is there. For the, 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 for the digestion of the, the heat will produce for digestion. So all the way you can feel by the heat in the, in the lower part of the stomach. So you also can also concentrate in the lower part of the stomach, then concentrate for a while and think about the heat. Then slowly, slowly you will feel that from there the heat is growing up to the upper body and spread to the lower um, lower part of the body. So easy you will feel by the, this way also you can try it. Anyway, you can try and vote. Another one is a cool feeling. Trying to concentrate on the in-breath, okay? Trying to, the time, trying to, when you're breathing in, and then you will feel what the cool feeling in the in-breath, you know? So trying to feel what in the nostril area, trying to breathe in. So it's just, you breathe, like it's, especially like it's winter time, you easily can feel it. When you're breathing, the air, cool air will come and touch the nostril, and trying to think about cool feeling, trying to feel about cool, cool. Then after for a while, when the breath is going in, you will feel what the cool feeling is going with the breath. So just now, same as the wind element, when you concentrate, the air is moving inside the face. At the same time, the cool feeling following with the in red. You will feel what the, at the moment when you concentrate, cool feeling is spread the whole face and then the whole body. Very comfortable, very peaceful. No need to use air condition. Huh? <laughs> just relax and think about cool feeling. That's good. You can relax. Huh? <laughs> Another one is 
cohesion, water element cohesion, and you can tuck your hand, both hand. So you're trying to use the energy to tuck. So after four while you feel a tightness in your hand, and you can start from there, the mind thing about tightness, 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 then slowly trying to feel the whole, uh, the whole body. Sometimes when you concentrate on the happiness, roughness, heaviness, after practicing water, easily you will feel what that cohesion feeling. The feeling of cohesion is very uncomfortable. You don't feel good with the breathing. You feel difficult to breathe, and also very tired. That feeling is it has cohesion. Sometimes you might get that experience from the practice. Yeah. Number twelve, the flowing. Flowing is you can try. You can choose when which one is more obvious to you. Either tears or the sweat or blood or urine, you can choose in the easier one. Some people easily can feel what tears when you get upset, very easy to drop tears. It is true. It is true. Yeah, some people some, some people get when you meditate, meditate after going very hot, you get a sweat, you know. So choose one which one's clearer and trying to feel what the flowing sensation in your your head and from it, so you start to feel then even saliva also okay. And after for a while you're trying to feel what the blood moving, the blood flowing from the heart base, slowly slowly trying to feel what the blood flowing to the whole body or urine, you can choose when. Then once the we trying to feel continuously about the whole body flowing, flowing, flowing. Depends on your concentration. When your concentration is good, all the muscle can be flowing down. So after flowing down for all the muscle, you only feel a skeleton in your body. This is very comfortable too. No need to be scared. The beginning you may be scared, but why my muscle is running down? Don't go and open your eyes. Let it be flowing down, flowing down. The matter. Just trying to, to wait in the, in the end of what will happen. The, in the end, all the muscle is flowing down. Green, green, down, dense, only skeleton. If you feel a skeleton, trying to concentrate on that skeleton, you can go and do first jhana. Very good. <laughs> Trying to feel more the feelings need to be clear one by one. Then after freezing about twelve characteristics, we our mind trying to overlook from the back to the whole body, either in front or the back, doesn't matter that you're trying to overload and trying to concentrate. Then is the mind focus start to practice for four groups. The first group earth element, hardness, roughness, heaviness, or smooth light. Six characteristics one by one we're trying to feel. One characteristic after feeling about the sensation, then change another characteristic. Trying to finish this characteristic, then only you feel you're trying to notice this earth element. And drawing water element, fire elements, and wind element. All twelve characteristics. The beginning make it clear slow, doesn't matter. After you feel satisfied, then trying to make it quick and trying to feel more energy and then feel that quickly trying to do it. Within a few minutes, you can feel about one round. Twelve characteristics is one round we can tell. There's trying to do it again and again. In the end, you can get concentration from practicing about the twelve characteristics. Then, uh, sorry. Then because of your concentration, slowly, slowly you feel about the color. And in from different area, you have feel some kind of bright light. Some people start to feel a spotlight shine to you, and some like yellow, orange, blue color. Any kinds of color appear in different area doesn't matter. Our duty is to need awareness on the body, trying to feel the sensation continuously. But try to stay one by one. Don't go and concentrate on the light. Now the light is very early, very early moment. The time you go and concentrate very quickly with the light, it disappears. So any kinds of color appear, doesn't matter, let it be. Keep on trying to concentrate element on element. So continuously trying the element sensation become lesser and lesser, not so clear as the beginning. Doesn't matter, trying to feel continuously, slowly, and then you feel slowly, slowly you get concentration. Then the body you feel very light and very comfortable. Then then so also stay need to feel what element. Then slowly, slowly the just now yellow, orange slowly turn to the white color. And uh, even turn to the white also give you with the element. In the end you will feel the element sensation and the light come and miss in your body. Some meditator appear in this way. Some meditators, they don't feel in this way. They will feel the white light is in front of you, can appear again and again. Then slowly, slowly turn to the clear glass or like 
and ice block. You will fever there. Then you wait and it's stable. When the clear light is stable, about five, ten minutes time, then the mind can concentrate on that limit, on the light, clear light. Inside of the body or in front of you, doesn't matter. As soon as you feel a clear light, it is stable, trying to relax and trying to do absorption. From there, you can go to the neighborhood of the jhana, from the absorption. Sorry. Then, this is the way how you can practice four elements meditation and the neighborhood of the jhana. In this way, you need to be balanced elements, then only the mind is happy. The mind also balanced, then easily get concentration. If not, you only choose one characteristic, the element is not balanced, very difficult to get concentration. That's the reason why I encourage us to practice systematically. And also, after practicing for that uh, neighborhood of the jhana, who want to go to the two part of body, you can continuously try to practice using the nimitta and concentration, neighborhood of the jhana concentration, to shine to the your body and concentrate to the your body and try to search one characteristic to another, all 32 parts of body, hair, hair, body hair, the skin, and knee, on teeth, and one by one trying to feed first, and then we practice 32 parts of body, internal and external, others, this is the several, then we will go continuously step by step. Yeah? If we can see all the organs in the body, it's very good for us to learn, and also very good knowledge for us. So when you see that the true thing, why inside our body? Only the organs, only the elements. It is true? Only organs and elements. True? Beautiful? <laughs> do, you, do you think beautiful or your organs? You see all uh, smelly or frequent? <laughs> smelly or frequent? Smelly, don't be scared. <laughs> very smelly inside, you know, also very scary. When you open operation time, you can see that when you open then the doctor open for the patient, you're trying to look at it inside the blood and everything, you know. You feel good? <laughs> yeah, repulses the our body. Then after we see the, oh, my inside is nothing special. How about others? You feel, then, then you just operate again, another one, then all the meditators. Huh? Tomorrow we have here some doctors, just open their, okay, <laughs> their body and cut it off with scissors, okay? So you look at it, everybody inside, where is inside? All organs, huh? 32 for our body, same, 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 32 for our body. Nothing special. It is true? How about elements? Also? Same. What is special? You cannot see any beauty or a repulsive not on it. There is the real things in our inside. That's the reason Buddha encourage us to look at it inside our body. Why is real? This reality of our rupa body. We so much attachment on our body. It is true. Are you have attachment to your body? <laughs> His answer, <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's the reason you spend so much money for the beauty, okay? <laughs> Need translation. <laughs> How about others? Do you like other people? <laughs> Do you love others? Simple question. Do you love to the others? Yes. <laughs> This is also true, you know, because uh, we don't really feel about 32 for our body. When you start to feel about 32 for our body, do you still want to love? <laughs> yes. <laughs> stay, want to love. Yes, as you see. So at the time on the Buddha, Buddha always encouraged to the student to look at it, everybody is skeleton. Look at it, Viva come to you, say in front of you, somebody is standing or walking. So when you look at it, people are skeleton, walking, and skeleton, standing. Do you still love? Do you still want to love? I don't think so, no, for me. I always look at all my students as skeleton, always, and sit down, all are skeleton. It is true? This is very good. Feel very good. And also myself is skeleton, okay? This is the true thing. So no need to attach too much to ourselves. No need to attach too much to your 
at your beloved, okay? And trying to let go of our attachment because we know what is the real things inside our body. I love my students because of their mind want to practice some meditation, not to the body. <laughs> it's good. You also same, trying to love each other because I want to practice of meditation. Come here for the Dharma, practice together. So good. Do you feel good with anybody? Yes. How beautiful when group doing good things and making good karma in the same place, same area, same room. And it's so beautiful. You cannot find it everywhere. But some meditation retreat you will see it. We have very little group in the, all over the world. You know? After you see about the two power body, we encourage all the meditator to practice skeleton meditation, internal, external. Then after that, your self skeleton trying to concentrate and the first jhana. After the self first jhana, we try to explain about why Krishna meditation from that skeleton. So today we already explain, okay? So from there, why Krishna we can practice and the arupa jhana, eight jhana. The reason why we practice again for white casino, sometimes when you practice for element meditation, you can go and the neighborhood of the jhana. Neighborhood of the jhana is very unstable, easily can drop, not very strong yet. That's reason we practice for white casino again and take four jhana. Four jhana concentration much much stable and stronger than neighborhood of the jhana. So we can make our concentration mind to be strong in that four jhana with why Kasina? After Sasafu, start to practice for Rupa, Nama and Rupa. No? Rupa is Mata in our body. Many people to them in the five aggregate method. So aggregate or Rupa Mata. As many people think that Rupa is the body, only the body. It is also one way people believe that. Just now, the 32 part of body, contemplating on the body, or the bodies, we can look at that body, cops. The one also we can contemplate about the process now body until you get a concentration or vipassana. But for the deeper vipassana session, we not enough for us to do it in this way. We need to penetrate inside. We have to make it into ultimate reality. Really have to break down in the whole body only particles we have to see in that way, but then only you can really can see what arising and passing about rupa matter. If you can see what arising and passing about particles or rupa, very difficult to analyze what impermanence. Then on the body, we trying to do four elements meditation, just not the beginning how we practice that, trying to penetrate. After four, one, you will see what the whole body is transparent like a glass and very bright, transparent glass appear in your body. So for this, then trying to penetrate again for elements meditation. So after four while in front of the body, you will feel all the particles are rising and passing, right down to the anti particles. So from there, particles and the small rupa, we can penetrate there. We can, the beginning, we can choose this transparent. Some, some particles transparent, brightness of particles, some are opaque. So then you can choose both, and then, then you can see what both types of particles, and trying to concentrate using for if you don't feel greedy, then try to do for jhana concentration again, absorption again. In much of the absorption, immediately trying to check, uh, trying to feel about the particles, and then trying to feel inside of the particle what is inside of the particles. Then slowly feel, trying to feel uh, elements, water, fire, and the way. Four elements in every particle inside have four elements foundation. You have feet. Now, when because of that four elements energy in one particle inside, so many particles in the group of the particles in your eyes. So in the eyes, in from there's many particles. Sometimes the heat sensation is stronger in the many particles. You have fever hot feeling in your eyes. Sometimes cool feeling is stronger in particles, you have feel about the cool feeling. Sometimes a lot of movement, vibration, wing element is stronger in those many particles. So you have because of many particles vibration is strong, you have feel shaking in your eyes. 
do you have interfering? Uh, so there is but not only sensation of hot and cold or vibration. We have to feel but all the particular inside of the element condition change of the element energy. Then only we really understand well, why we can feel by the energy in the sensation because the inside elements controlled by the energy of the quality of the elements in the particles. So many particles are rising and passing, rising and passing, but the energy is still growing, growing, growing. The heat energy will produce in the next generation, the next generation. Then from there, start growing up, growing up, the sensation is getting stronger and stronger. And also the sensation is sometimes connected with your mind also. The mind power also very strong and powerful. When your mind thinking about the heat, all the things of the chiricha rupa were produced too. Then the temperature will green up again. Then the temperature green up, then from there start you feel the heat feeling strong. The healer trying to feel in trying to heal to the others. So you use it in this way, you're trying to feed the energy inside in his body first, make it the strong heat. Then after that the mind trying to focus to the somebody who are really sick. They really want to have using the energy to focus on their work or their patient to the which part of the body is not so good and trying to concentrate on that area. At the same time, if we, different people have different way of treatment. For the healer, he was using the heat power from, the, from his body to transfer to the, to the patient. There's a heat element, using the heat element can spread to the outside, you know. Internet or external. Do you believe on it? <laughs> Try next time, okay? Believe or not, okay? So you can feel, you, the, the patient can feel sometimes. It depends on the person who do it. The person, if power is strong, the patient can feel it. Same as Mitta, who send Mitta loving kindness, and as you send to somebody, if your Mitta is strong, really powerful, people can receive it. Do you believe? Do you believe, do you receive any meta from anybody? <laughs> Not from your wife or husband, okay? <laughs> Just feeling of something meta, okay? Different types of meta, okay? So somebody already sent to you meta, you must feel. If your concentration is good, you really is really you feel. If your concentration is not good, people send you meta to you while you are sleepy. <laughs> Can you receive or not? Not easy to receive, okay? Okay? So if you want to receive, you're trying to make it more effort and the practice using effort, then only you easily you feed. So who sent him meta, the person also saying the powers from their heart base and using really intention to using the with cooling energy or using the shine and the meta to the person. Intention, very pure intention, very peaceful feeling to spot to support spread to the other people. So because of his power, the person could receive sometimes with bright light from the person okay. and you who received it. So you can feed the bright light first, after they could feed the energy of a peaceful feeling come and attack to your heart base. And you feel what immediately cooling feeling. At the same time you have feed the person faced. You know who sent to you. Understand? Understand? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to believe, okay? <laughs> Trying to practice. Yes, slowly you will feel the person. Imagery when you receive the feeling about peaceful feeling and meet uh, from somebody. At the same time, you saw the image. Oh, she sent a meta to me. He sent a meta to me. Really, you will feel it. Trying to do that. And then, Buddha, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> The Buddha also use it in this way, no? So, so he always send uh, metta and compassion to the, to, the, to the monk or the nuns or the lay disciple. Always using metta to shine, to the, using at the same time with light. So that's when you, you receive about the metta power, you will feel immediately cooling and very peaceful feeling arise. Then after that, the mind already change. Your mind to be immediately you will feel a wholesome feeling because of Buddha sent him metta, the power you could receive it. So in this way, he has been trying many people to teach him the Dharma, easily can spread, you know. So we can try in this way too, you practice and do very, very strong concentration, and also not only concentration, you really need your intention, you need to be pure, you really want them to be free from suffering. 
and then it's only that's meta. Sometimes you can put it if what you want. You want them to be cool feeling, or you want them to get hot feeling. At the same time, with meta, you can send the person to the person. They can receive at the same time cool or hot feeling anyway. Okay, so very beautiful, suitable for yourself. Very benefit. Suitable means you can be balanced. Element when you feel sick, you trying to element is not balanced. You can be balanced by yourself. Easily can be recover. Even cancer can cure by the element meditation. You know, also for the practice of vipassana, just now what we explain, and the ultimate reality, you have to see rupa, mata arising and passing. So we need to see inside clearly. The Buddha encourage us to see. So if you can see, but then you also can feel what elements in inside. So it's important to penetrate inside. What is inside? After you feel about that, so element is very basis of vipassana too. So very important to us to learn. After practicing both elements meditation and the vipassana, then you might attend and this sort of fun, okay? Tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> After you this sort of fun, if you want to practice psychic power, we still need to come back for elements again. For elements of the casino, earth casino, water casino, fire casino, wind casino, fall color casino, light casino, and in the space casino, ten casino, we have to use again for the basis of the avenue psychic powers. No, if you want to learn, very easy to the time. So after sort of fun only, I will explain how to practice. Not now, not now. Okay. So when you want to practice psychic power, we have to tip it again for. Casino again, and the uh, casino first jana to eight jana, and then again, again we have to do it fourteen ways of penetrating up and down and jumping here and there. You know, all fourteen ways. You you need to be very expert. Within one second, you have to finish first jana, second jana. Okay, one second, one jana have to finish in the end. So the minds cannot sleep. Okay cannot be relaxed. The mind is very fast. Then only you understand how fast for our mind. Very, very quickly movement. Within movement, you have to follow it about that. But it's very interesting. And also the mindfulness is getting strong. Don't think that when using, practicing about jhana is wasting time. Jhana's thought process, uh, absorption time is all a wholesome thought process. And a wholesome creating wholesome karma. One minute you do absorption, that's the vision of wholesome karma. Understand? So don't don't be confused by that. Don't think that wasting time or need to stay with the meta. Okay, this uh, also when you practice for this is good for your karma and also because you make it in the fourteen ways, up and down and again and again, the mind is very sharp and very quick, very powerful. And the mindfulness becomes stronger and stronger. Then after you successful by that, okay, what kinds of psychic power you want? Very easy. Very easy, not difficult, not indeed, if you want, easy to get also. And the psychic power has six kinds of psychic power. The first one you want to see about many, many past life, and then uh, or not only ordinarily knowing about the past life, and also at the same time you can check your relatives, your names, and where you are, everywhere you can check by psychic power. This is very detailed. This is also one kind of psychic power to know in past life. Number two, diva eyes. And like a diva eyes, you can see, you are all covered by the wall, but you can penetrate inside, why is that? The kind of psychic power, and you can look at it. Even you can see heaven, you can also penetrate under the ground to the hell being so, because of that strong psychic power, so, diva eyes. And also, diva ear, you can listen from one kuti to another kuti. <laughs> ah. Can you hear? <laughs> Somebody talked from the other room. Can you hear sometimes? <laughs> yes, you have the ears there. <laughs> you can hear from distant area, you know. This, this you can hear from everywhere. You know? So when you when you need to concentrate step by step, you need to press the imagery, you can't do it. You're trying to learn and trying to listen about the insect, the song of the insect, slowly trying to feel it. Then it's a circle with the next one in the room, and also step and step and the next reading, next reading, this way. So it depends on your power. Who uh, came from the Deva range? Previous life, you might be in the heaven. 
who come from there to, to, for that kind of people easily can practice what Sakya Baba because originally they have that before. So when you come back, not so difficult. Would not come from a Diva when you had to practice art. You know? <laughs> 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 because of the Diva eyes and Diva ear, they call. You know? Are you talking in the room? Please answer. <laughs> I tell you lie, you know. So before then you all promised me not to talk in the room. It is true? <laughs> Who stay alone in Kurita, yes, you know. <laughs> Who not stay alone when it's never answer, you know. You better follow the rules. It is important. All those small characteristics, small rules, if you are not following, you become heavy. You don't know how to respect the rules. I trust all of you, you know? Because of that, I didn't come and chat to all of you. If you do you trust yourself? Do you understand what it means? Do you trust yourself? <laughs> you trust yourself, I will never talk. I will follow the rules strictly. Who don't trust one, scared to answer my question. <laughs> All of you are so brave. You know, so brave. Why I tell you so brave? You don't scared about breaking the rules in front of people. <laughs> it is true? <laughs> Only one answer. <laughs> oh, very good. The rest of it is, you know, talk, talk. The rule is cannot talk. You talk, don't want to, you are falling. But you talk in front of people and you talk in the room, but you don't be shamed. But I look at you, I'm shamed. Quickly, I turn my, my face, you know, I don't look at all of you. Why? Why? I don't look at all of you when you are talking. I feel a bit. Uh, shameful for you, you know, not because I'm ashamed myself, you know. I, I, if I look at them, maybe when they look at me, they might be a bit uneasy or shameful. That's the reason I don't look at you only. <laughs> Understand? So, please try to be ashamed to breaking of the rules. <laughs> Please take care of yourself, okay? Yes. Do you want me to take care of you? I'm tired to talk. I will use the cane this time, okay? <laughs> when I see all of you talking, I will beat you. <laughs> no need to talk. Good or not good? Good. <laughs> okay. Tomorrow I will use the cane to move around to the center. <laughs> 那小孩说我们要自己照顾自己好不好 Talk a lot, it's not good for your concentration, not because I want to control you or too strict or what. I don't want to be this way. Because I worry about your concentration. No, I don't want you to waste your time. That's the reason we try to be straight. No. 那讲话，如果我们讲话讲的很多呢，这是不好的，这个对于我们的定义来说呢，是不没有好处的。所以不是因为说小姐想要控制我们，是因为说她担心说我们的这个定力呢会有问题，所以她不想要我们浪费时间
Another psychic power is you reach the other people's minds. That's also very good. And if you can learn, but sometimes very dangerous too. Because last time I went to learn of how the other told don't, don't practice this one. Very dangerous, he told it. Because I don't really believe what he told now. But after that, I believed it. Because when you, you, you're trying to, you're trying to fever, no need to use psychic power. You're trying to know what people minds. Sometimes very dangerous. So many unwholesome thoughts. When you feel what effect to your heart base, or why like that, why they feel that way, why they feel that, you know? It is true? So all over the world you go, sometimes you feel what the energy is, a lot of great anger direction based on that. Wholesome and then who want to meditate. It's very little people only like to be, to be doing for the Dhamma and uh, to be a wholesome, you know? It is true? Yeah, and not easy to find a good energy and a good heart, very difficult. Who want to practice other the Dhamma, then only they believe a karma, they scared to do by unwholesome thought, then only you feel good. So always I would like to spend my time is with the meditation retreat every year, the whole year for our schedule. I like to stay with meditators because within 10 days course, people like to practice Nova Sanglam, people like to do it for meditation, want to listen on Dhamma. So I feel very good with the people. It is true. This is the way we uh, affect good. I don't, I don't like to go and visit or even Dana. I don't, I don't want to associate so many people. Because, not because uh, we are scared about people. Although we, we can forgive people, but people easily can do any mistake and their thought is creating a lot of unwholesome karma sometimes criticizing and because of many problems. So we better don't make any bad karma to anybody. Just really practice silent our said is better. Good. So you can reach people's minds okay how people practice. If we don't know how people practice and what they are doing so and go and criticize our doings in different ways. It's very dangerous. Mm-hmm. Another one is you can create what kinds of image you want, and also if you want to fly into the sky, in the sky, and then inside the air, and they're also easy one place to another place. Within one second, without airplane, you can go by psychic power. And there's also one kind of psychic power. So, one person to a few people, and one, one, and also sometimes one thousand people. You can create by psychic power too. Depends on your parami. Paramis need to be very good. That psychic power. Also creating by your mind, no, not by the artificial. No, so just trying to create your mind, powerful mind, and trying to do. Well, okay, I want to see another one, another person, same image by you. So trying to do or one person or two, three people. But you need to understand before you do determination, it need to be very clear. Need to be clear, okay, another person need to be sit down position or standing position. You need to do determination first. If not, you just do that, oh, I want another two people. So then so when the image immediately appears, you don't know how to handle. The person is jumping, jumping, or coming into you. You don't know how to handle, you get scared. So the fear can be arise too. So without teacher, a bit difficult to practice that. So you need in the book also they did mention about much that. So you really need guidance from the teacher. So before that, you need to make it clear. Another person, I want sitting position. I want another person walking or standing or doing determination first. Then after that, only you really creating but. And then um, for jhana and determination for the, the psychic power, then after that you will see the image of what you want to exactly appear in front of you. This also you can do now and day. Don't be confused, but you need power, strong power. No? And also sometimes you want to fly in the sky, and then you need psychic power to see. Deva eyes need to see, okay, we didn't hear to think about how many mountains in between. <laughs> if not, just go, go and not from a mountain, also cannot, okay? It's time to use psychic power to look there first, the journey. Then on the way, you see what the mountain So on that mountain, you need to do space in a small hole. Last time we already teach here, some people already practice fifth channel object. When you see what the small hole trying to penetrate in the mountain using the space casino, 
So you will see what inside the mountain is the hole, big hole. Then there's you just going inside the hole, okay? So when you want to move in, you want to go sitting position or standing position using wind element to push up. So just now we already explained wind element meditation. When your concentration is strong, after determination you can be broke up to the world body dig up then you can move, then move in you can, can go within one second and reach there sometimes you see the water you have to cross in front of water you cannot walk you're trying to make a determination this water i want to be at the earth but we the earth we can this earth no water only the earth it is very interesting for you to do it Try and try, nobody can do it. <laughs> okay if you can let go by your family you can let go of your job if you have part of me. I went explain. I really want to explain about the Dhamma. I really don't want to lose the kind of Dhamma. Please try hard. You know, before I die, I really want to explain to somebody. Okay, so I want you to get our hand in this lifetime. And also I want you to get very, very good psychic power with you. Then it's so very good for future generation. You all can carry on to teach people. Really need many teachers. Do you want to have Voda Voda Sasana? Hey, <laughs> <laughs> no answer. <laughs> <laughs> Not only for yourself. After you try to have people, this is good. We don't have energy you now going down, going down. So we need people to support each other. No? Now, if you cannot get jhana or concentration, no need to get upset. Don't need to, no need to cry, no need to get upset. Trying to be happy, trying to practice continuously. Encourage yourself to be strong. So, one of the bhikkhu also said in the time of the Buddha, every year after Vasa, oh, and uh, now you have been anything, crying again, crying again, crying every year. No? So then one of the devas cannot stand. After you crying, what happened to you? <laughs> Nothing. So, so crying is useless. Trying to put more effort and practice more. Then when time strikes, you will be successful. It is true? Yeah, trying to be happy. You are doing wholesome thing. You are not doing any unwholesome. Making happiness in your heart. Don't worry about the result. I mean, we are staying waiting. I'm mean, staying waiting for you to get jhana, okay? <laughs> Sorry for wrong talk. Please try to practice again. Don't get upset. Try to be happy. I always want to see all of you with happy feeling and happy face, okay? <laughs> Okay? <laughs> yeah, no happy, also trying to be smart. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Sadhu, Sadhu, Sadhu.